When a certain person had asked Albert Einstein if he stood on the shoulders of Newton, he replied, no, on the shoulders of Maxwell. Here are 10 facts about James Clark Maxwell. 1. Birth and Early Life James Clark Maxwell was born on June 13, 1831, in Edinburgh, Scotland. He was the only child of John Clark Maxwell, an advocate and man of letters, and Francis Kay, an accomplished pianist. Even as a child, Maxwell displayed a prodigious intellect and a remarkable curiosity for the natural world. His father in a letter written in 1834 when James about three years old remarked of him. He is a very happy man, and has improved much since the weather got moderate. He has great work with doors, locks, keys, etc., and, show me how it does, is never out of his mouth. He also investigates the hidden course of streams and bell wires, the way the water gets from the pond through the wall. His early education was provided by his mother and private tutors, fostering his interest in mathematics and physics from an early age. 2. Rings of Saturn Maxwell made significant contributions to the understanding of the rings of Saturn. In 1859 he won the esteemed Adams Prize of Cambridge University by publishing a paper titled, On the Stability of the Motion of Saturn's Rings, where he used mathematical analysis to demonstrate that the rings could not be solid structures. Instead, he proposed that the rings consisted of numerous small particles, each in its own orbit around Saturn. This insight revolutionized the study of planetary rings and laid the foundation for future discoveries about their composition and behavior. 3. Stresses of solids. In 1853, at about the age of 22, Maxwell published a paper titled, On the Equilibrium of Elastic Solids. In this paper, he examined the equilibrium conditions of deformable elastic materials, contributing significantly to the understanding of how solids respond to external forces and deformations. His work laid the groundwork for the field of elasticity and provided important insights into the behavior of materials under stress. Maxwell's paper focused on the equilibrium equations for elastic solids subjected to various forces and deformations. He derived equations that described the balance of internal and external forces within a solid in equilibrium. Maxwell introduced the concept of stress, which represents the internal forces distributed within a material due to applied external loads. He also introduced the idea of strain, which represents the deformation experienced by a material in response to these forces. Maxwell's work contributed to the development of mathematical models that describe the mechanical behavior of materials under various loading conditions. His insights paved the way for subsequent advancements in the theory of elasticity. 4. First Color Photograph In 1861, Maxwell produced the world's first color photograph by taking three separate black and white photographs of a ribbon, each through a different colored filter, red, green, and blue. He then projected the three images using the same filters to create a full color image. This pioneering work laid the groundwork for color photography and the principle of color vision that underpins modern color reproduction technologies. 5. Maxwell's Demon Maxwell's thought experiment, known as Maxwell's Demon, challenged the second law of thermodynamics by proposing a hypothetical creature that could sort particles based on their energy. An excerpt from his initial letter on the subject is as follows. If we conceive of a being whose faculties are so sharpened that he can follow every molecule in its course, such a being, whose attributes are as essentially finite as our own, would be able to do what is impossible to us. For we have seen that molecules in a vessel full of air at uniform temperature are moving with velocities by no means uniform, though the mean velocity of any great number of them, arbitrarily selected, is almost exactly uniform. Now let us suppose that such a vessel is divided into two portions, A and B, by a division in which there is a small hole, and that a being, who can see the individual molecules, opens and closes this hole, so as to allow only the swifter molecules to pass from A to B, and only the slower molecules to pass from B to A. He will thus, without expenditure of work, raise the temperature of B and lower that of A, in contradiction to the second law of thermodynamics. 
This seemed to violate the law of increasing entropy. Maxwell's demon sparked discussions about the relationship between information theory and thermodynamics, contributing to the development of concepts like entropy and information entropy. 6. Thermodynamics and Kinetic Theory Maxwell's contributions to the kinetic theory of gases were pivotal in understanding the behavior of particles at the microscopic level. He developed the Maxwell-Boltzmann distribution, which describes the distribution of particle speeds in a gas at a given temperature. This distribution forms the basis for understanding concepts like temperature and pressure in terms of the motion of individual molecules. 7. Maxwell's Equations Maxwell's most famous achievement was the unification of electricity and magnetism through his set of equations, now known as Maxwell's Equations. He formalized the laws of electromagnetism into a coherent mathematical framework, predicting the existence of electromagnetic waves that propagate at the speed of light. This unification marked a profound shift in our understanding of nature, setting the stage for the development of modern physics and technologies. The four main equations are as follows. Gauss's law for electricity describes how electric charges create electric fields. Gauss's law for magnetism describes that there are no magnetic monopoles and how magnetic fields circulate around currents. Faraday's law of electromagnetic induction explains how changing magnetic fields induce electric currents. Ampere's law with Maxwell's addition describes the relationship between magnetic fields and electric currents, including the effects of displacement currents. 8. Electromagnetic waves. In his equations, Maxwell realized that they predicted the existence of electromagnetic waves. He concluded that light itself was an electromagnetic wave, a revolutionary idea that unified optics with electromagnetism. This insight connected the fields of electricity, magnetism, and light, paving the way for later breakthroughs in communication technology and wireless transmission. 9. Christian Faith Maxwell was a devout Christian and believed that the order and harmony in the universe reflected the work of a divine creator. He saw his scientific pursuits as a way to appreciate and understand the intricate design of the natural world. Maxwell's deep faith and commitment to science were reflected in his writings and personal correspondence. One of the numerous quotes of Maxwell regarding his faith is, I mean, that I have the capacity of being more wicked than any example that man could set me, and that if I escape, it is only by God's grace. 10. Death and Legacy. James Clark Maxwell passed away on November 5, 1879, at the age of 48 due to abdominal cancer. Despite his relatively short life, his contributions to science continue to influence the world. His equations laid the foundation for modern physics and technology, leading to breakthroughs in fields such as telecommunications, electronics, and particle physics. Maxwell's work also inspired subsequent generations of scientists, including Albert Einstein, who built upon his ideas to develop the theory of relativity. James Clark Maxwell's legacy endures through his profound impact on multiple scientific disciplines, his innovative ideas, and his unwavering pursuit of knowledge. His contributions continue to shape our understanding of the universe and the technologies we rely on today. Thank you again for watching. Please like and subscribe for more interesting facts about our world.